Good morning. Well, state lawmakers are expected to approve some of the language in the Maryland Trust Act. It would have prohibited local police from asking a person's immigration status. Governor Hogan promised a veto and that legislation was withdrawn, but the local police angle is included in another immigration bill set to be considered today. Among other things on the table, opioids. Some of the bills being considered are uh, would set limits rather on opioid prescriptions. Another would expand opioid education programs in schools. Schools. Lawmakers are also hoping to amend the state's medical marijuana law to help achieve racial diversity. It currently allows for 15 licenses. The Legislative Black Caucus wants to increase that by five. Another bill being considered would allow Attorney General Brian Frosch to sue drug companies for suspected price gouging without approval from the legislature or governor. Now, the Senate will also look at emergency legislation that would stop Internet service providers from selling a consumer's personal information uh, that that comes in direct opposition to a bill passed by Congress and signed into law. And remember, this is the last day of the legislative session. Whatever doesn't pass the House and the Senate by midnight tonight will have to be introduced next year as it will be considered dead. Reporting live from Annapolis this morning, Omar Jimenez, WBAL-TV 11 News.